accept this, that doesn't mean you accept the statement. I have a dream, that's all I need. I'll make it happen with some work and belief. What I'm going to do right now is I'm going to show you how you can find uh, the terms and then you know how to find it and then we're going to look at it. So, let's go to the internet. As you can see here, I already have the terms of signal, the terms of condition of telegram, and the privacy policy of telegram. So let's see how we can find these kind of things. So let's go back, go back to Google. See this is Google. Only thing what you need to do is just type, let's say signal terms. You see it here, you find the signal terms. That's it. If you are looking for the terms of uh, Telegram, you type Telegram terms, you find it here. Same apply for WhatsApp, WhatsApp terms, privacy and terms, and then we have everything. The thing is, um, I'm going to show you some things. So you can understand what I mean. Um, first thing first, let's look at the terms of WhatsApp. Second, terms of Telegram. So you see we have terms of Telegram. Okay. If you look at WhatsApp here, you see WhatsApp.com legal client, right? If you go down here, you see the information of WhatsApp, right? You go up. It's important to know some things about WhatsApp. Let's say WhatsApp. Let's go to WhatsApp.com. I'm going to show you some things. See this WhatsApp.com future download interest security. If you're here, you can go down. And here you can find the privacy, privacy and terms. So they put those things together. So let's say privacy and terms you will go to legal you see terms of services you understand it and here you see privacy policy yeah what I want you guys to see and also understand is if you look at whatsapp they have um, intellectual property policy so if you're using whatsapp the intellectual property like the brand or other stuff name these are the guidelines how to use it cookies payments if you do use that kind of payments on whatsapp and whatsapp shop privacy policy interesting yeah this is the business app so if you have the business future for whatsapp not, i think not everybody has them when you look at this video but when you have the business app, these are the privacy policy and terms of services and the API or other stuff. So here we have the terms of WhatsApp and here we have the privacy policy. Interesting. Yeah. So thing is, these are the three companies that we're going to discuss. We can start with the easy one. And then we can go to the difficult one but we can also start with the difficult one then go to the easy one and as you can see this is the easy one this is the normal one and this is the difficult one because whatsapp has a lot of things into it and what i'm trying to say is if we're going to look at whatsapp we need to look at a deep dive because we need to look at the uh, specific because um when you look at WhatsApp, you will see that WhatsApp um, is part of Facebook and they have certain kind of things in the privacy policy that can go too far or uh, not. But that applies for, lot of, uh, for every company that I'm going to discuss, but we're going to look at it. So we're going to start with the easy one and also the most normal one, Signal. And if you see here, Signal has its terms and privacy in one. So if you see it like this, let me see if I can show you. Hope oh, this is working. It's in. Yeah. 
so if you see it like this yeah i have whatsapp but um I was planning to stop with WhatsApp, but we're gonna look at uh, Signal. So give me one second. Let's say, let me change the title to draw. Draw, yeah. So if you see it like this, WhatsApp normally have this, the terms, and the privacy policy. So Signal has those two in one that's nothing wrong with that but because the privacy policy is a statement and the terms here are the terms that you need to accept that's nothing wrong with that but when you accept this that doesn't mean you accept the statement hope you understand what i mean because in my video i always explain that you do not need to accept the privacy policy it's just the rules or this just inform you about your privacy policy what they do is they put these two together and they say if you accept the terms you also accept the privacy policy technically it doesn't work like that but if you accept this the statement about privacy policy doesn't matter but the statement about how to use their their platform the rules about how to use the platform that does matter what you accept so it doesn't matter when you look at privacy policy so it's possible to put those two in one but again you do not need to accept the privacy policy yeah if you look back we see signal and they have the two things together because if i press here it's the same but only this part about our services yeah and if i go back privacy policy information you provide so technically they're saying the terms will start you see this part here this is the privacy policy and above is the terms of services so technically it's not that big i have a dream that's all i need i'll make it happen with some work and belief know what i want so i'll take it on i've made mistakes but mistakes make you strong Let's break it down for a minute I want the crown, I'm gon' get it You hear me loud, man, I'm winning Yeah, Charlie Sheen would be great